What's the mustache about? Our fathers, brothers, partners, and friends are facing a health crisis. Men are dying too young, and we can't afford to stay silent. See below on how you can help. Spend time with people who make you feel good. Stay connected. Being with your friends is important, so make time for your friends. Make it a priority. Talk more. You don't have to be the solution or an expert, but sharing time can actually save someone's life. So listen and be there for them. Did you know that 70% 70, 70 of men say that others can rely on them, but only 48% say that they rely on other people. So we're there for others, but we don't allow ourselves to be helped. Let's change that. At 50, have a conversation with your doctor about prostate cancer and whether you should take the PSA test. If you're of Caribbean or African descent, or if your father or brother has prostate cancer, you should have that conversation at 45. Know your numbers, know your risks, and stay safe. Know thy nuts. It's that simple. Know what's normal for your testicles. Check them regularly and go to your doctor if something doesn't feel right. <laughs> Move more, stay active, stay alive. You can take a walk at the park. You can take a walking meeting. You can walk up the stairs instead of taking the lift. You can cycle to work instead of driving. The choices are endless. Prostate cancer is the most common cancer for men in Europe. Early detection can be the difference between life and death. So read below to see who's at risk and what they can do about it. Not everyone experiences symptoms of prostate cancer. Most times, signs of prostate cancer are detected by doctors during a checkup. However, there are some signs that might appear during urinary or sexual functions. So see below some symptoms and signs of prostate cancer. Testicular cancer is the most common cancer for men of ages 15 to 39. At 95%, the odds of survival are better than good. So help us, help these men get back to a long and healthy life. Be proactive when it comes to testicular cancer. The best thing you can do for your testicles is give them a feel every month or so and if something doesn't feel right, then just go to the doctor. If you need more information on how to do a self-check, read below. Movember Power Yoga classes are back. Join me on Thursday evenings online or on Friday evenings at the Glow Yoga Studio Barcelona and everything you donate will go to over 1,250 health projects to help men live longer. Contact me and save your spot. The results of poor mental health are deadly. Globally, a man dies every minute of suicide. Most men don't recognize that they're experiencing mental health issues and many are uncomfortable to ask for help. So the uncomfortable truth is that men are dying because of some stereotypical forms of masculinity. With COVID-19, daily life as we knew it has been turned on its head. There are some steps you can take, however, in order to stay healthy and happy. 
If you need some tools and resources to start a conversation with someone who's struggling, check out the new tool, Movember Conversations. And I'll be talking more about this in my next posts. Ask. The first step to approaching someone is asking. Pick up on something that's different lately. If they've changed their behavior, if they haven't been answering to their texts, and don't be afraid to ask twice, trust your instinct. Second of all, listen. Give him your full attention. Let him know you're listening and you're not judging. You don't have to offer solutions. You don't have to diagnose problems. Just ask questions and let him know you're listening. After actively listening to what he's been telling you, encourage him to take action. Start with the simple things. He can start by focusing on getting enough sleep, drinking enough water, eating well, exercising, and maybe there's other things that have helped him in the past. It's worth listening, it's worth asking. And ask him to share this with other people. Encourage him to share it because that will take some pressure off you too and if he's been feeling low for over two weeks then suggest that he may talk to a doctor a specialist but you're not done check in follow up your conversation with a phone call or a video call so that you let them know that you care and so that you get a feel whether they're feeling better Did you know that the whole Movember thing started with two Australian friends having drinks and deciding to grow a beer for the month? They recruited 30 friends of theirs and this whole thing started conversations and the next year it started to be charitable. What started off as 30 Australian men growing moustaches for fun ended up in more than six million people using this moustache symbol as a symbol to fund more than 1,250 health projects all around the world. This is not just an issue for men. We should all take action on an individual and a community level. Men, women, businesses, sport groups, community organizations, governments, healthcare providers, we should all engage to take action to reduce this current gender inequality in health outcomes around the world.